That was the that was my last dance at my freshman homecoming. I never heard that. I literally had never heard that song until the last dance at my freshman homecoming. Do one of you have long fingernails? No, I have the opposite. I'm a nail Why did I bring this with me if I can't even fucking open it? I'll do it with my teeth. If I have to. Yay! Okay. This is also oh, a it's huge beautiful. throwback. This, you will not even believe how many fucking views this has. I opened it for her. Wait. Oh my god, this is like a bit great. Yeah! Bing, bing. <laughs> Hi guys, this is Inu from React to the K, and look what I've got. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Look what I've got here. Woo! From the second that the first teaser photo was released, I was like, oh my god, oh my god, I gotta get this album. I am digging every single thing about this. So first things first, I absolutely love, can maybe kind of see, but the letters pop out on the front. And then when you turn it to the side, the words peekaboo pop out too. Then this is the back. And the spot where you can open it. Please don't fuck this up, Emma. Oh my god, I'm totally gonna fuck it up. Wait, do you open it that way or do you just slide it out? How do I open this? I don't open it that way, do I? <gasps> no, I don't. I just slide it out. But it isn't coming out. Oh, it came out! Yay! <laughs> I'm used to like the sides of an album where it's there's a magnet and you can open and close it. I've never gotten a K-pop album that was actually just like a CD, so this is a first. I don't like that sound. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's like a pizza box. And then, in the back. Perfect velvet since 2014. Oh, I love this a lot. It's the pizza that Joy and Wendy were playing with in the music video. Oh my god, what the hell? I'm just so in love with this concept. <laughs> oh my god, there are stains like the CD is a pizza. The book I damaged a tiny bit when I was opening it. Let's see if... Ah! I got Wendy! Look how beautiful she is. Ta-da! I'm curious to why some photo cards are selfies and some are like legit photo shoot pictures. Um, I've gotten mostly selfie photo cards, but a few Mama Moo ones were like legit photo shoot pictures and same with Dreamcatcher. So is it because all the photo cards, some are photo shoot pictures and some are selfies or do they choose like every other album will take a selfie for the photo card and do an actual photo shoot for the next album? like. I wonder what their process is in deciding what the photo card should be. I'm sure it's different for every company. Okay, time for the- Ooh, I love, I love, I love, I love, I love, I love! I love it so much! It's so creepy! I live for gorgeously creepy things. Alright, so the photo book starts off with that album cover picture and then ooh hoo hoo! Ho 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 ho! Oh, look at that. Someone's got a gun. The next photos that I'm about to show you, I love the editing on how they, I don't know, it's like one of those Instagram filters that you put on photos that make your skin less uh, yellow, I think it is. And it's like darker, more faded. I guess the filter is like faded old style photo or something like that. I love these so much. Okay, I know a lot of people's opinion has been that it's Joy's era, but I'm one of the people who believes it's Yuri's era. Cause oh my God, she just freaking slays this short hair. It makes her look so much more mature. I love the way every single picture is framed. I love the color editing. I love the lighting. I, I, I just look, look. Black, white, picture that takes up the left side of the page, but not the whole left side. 
and tiny small picture on this side. Like I just love the balance between these two and then the only color that pops out is the green right here. Like I'm no photographer, but I just, oh my God. I love everything about this. When I saw this teaser photo for the first time, I gaped at it for about five minutes. Just like amazed at how cool it is. Man, man, it's just... So Dreamcatcher has had my favorite photo books so far and albums, but man, is this coming close. I love the fact, you know, the pizza is on top of the picture here and it's below here. They just got so creative with every single thing. I love it. Come on. I guess like glue got in the way and so it kind of messed up the pictures in the middle. Photo editors. Ah! Ah! At the moment, I'm just showing you my favorite pictures, but before I bought the album, I was kind of hesitant because SM posted so many pictures of Red Velvet. I thought to myself, like, how many new pictures could there be in this photo book? Like, is it really worth it? Oh! Oh my God, is it worth it? Other than the fact that this quality is pretty shitty. Like, the color and the actual photos came out okay, but the binding of the book was bad. Like, I feel some clothes that companies make their idols wear is just kind of embarrassing because they're just so, so, so out. Like, I know some people really dig it, but in this case, I feel like the clothing is really out, but also it's so stylish that it works 100%. Those shoes! Those shoes, guys. I am loving those shoes. Peeking into the pizza truck, right? What a cute photo to end the album. The end. Okay, absolutely no regrets in buying this. Even though inside the photo book, some of the glue ran over and messed up the edges of the photos. Other than that, I am overjoyed with the creativeness of this album and just how different and unique each photo is and how like gorgeous all the girls are. Now the real question is how to get uh, the book and the CD back into the cover. But anyways, thanks for watching guys. I hope I maybe inspired you to buy the album because it's so beautiful. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.